Hey guys, it's me Luke and today I'm going to be showing you a video of a computer of course. Anyway, what's this one today? This one I've had since about late July of 2013. I actually remember the day I even bought it, but it was it July 25th. And this was at a first store and it was one of those rare, oper there was two systems. It was this one and another one which was Sadly, I passed up what would have been an awesome Windows 95 gaming computer. Never got it, and I actually kind of regret not getting it since I've never found another computer there ever since. Well, except for one, and I couldn't even buy that one. Anyway, this is a compact Bessaria 2510 from 1998. Has a Intel, no, it's not Intel, it's an AMD K6 3D running at 300 megahertz. 48 megs of RAM. Uh, this is not the original keyboard. This is actually the original keyboard that came out of the Compact Presario 5461. It came with it. But that one I'm almost sure is toast unless I find a new motherboard. Anyway, uh, this, I read about this computer and originally it was one of those late Windows 95 computers that Plain honestly should have stayed on 95, but they wanted to get in. This was manufactured like four days after Windows 98 was released, and I, it, um, it was originally shipped with Windows 95 in a Windows 98 upgrade. Hold on, let me turn on the light. That's better. It was originally shipped with Windows 95 and upgrade to Windows 98, but then. They ended up shipping it with this design for Windows 98. It has the weird design where the power button, the button's on the front, and the power thing is the supply, which turns it on on, on the back. And these LEDs don't work. I think they're due to age. And I got this computer for ten dollars, and it was originally twenty, but I. As I bargained to ch ch change it to $10 since it was in such rough, rough shape when I first got it. And when I first got it, there was a there was a CD, a previous CD-ROM. It was not original. It was from like 1995. And and uh, it, after that, I ended up uh, putting a different one in. That, that was the closest I could find. Anyway, this computer uh, had to do a lot of work to it, but now it's pretty good. Anyway, without further ado, let's turn it on. And it's running factory install Windows 90. And... And, uh, I ended up at first, first it was really, really slow, and this is the fastest I could ever get to it. And it would be really, really cool if I could get the f recovery discs for this, and that might not happen for a while. And I'm planning on trying to find if I could get the bezel board for this, so it'll actually, the lights will light up. But that will not happen for a while, probably, and... Man, it's a focus. And my username, of course, Luke Junker. So let's log on. And Aquaware DC EXE, I think this was a program that came with it. I had a lot of stuff on here, but I ended up removing all, most of it, except for the stuff that came with it, of course. And, uh, and, uh, what else does it have? It has, has all the stuff, the usual stuff that came with it, and what's one computer game I could play without it having the need a CD? Oh, SimCity 2000, I'll definitely check. It out later. Um, properties. 
So this is registered to me, of course. It was originally registered to a name I will not say, because to protect the previous owner. Manufactured and supported by Compact, Compact Computer Corporation, Presario, Authentic AMD, AMD K6 3D processor with Intel MMX technology and 48 megs of RAM. Um, it's billed for 10998 but because of me trying to install USB on it, I ended up making it uh, 222 uh, 2. And let's see all the stuff. Intel A2371SB, PCI to USB and Universal Host Controller. All the stuff. Um, Pentium processor to PC iBridge. Don't know what that means, but. Oh, is it? Might be an Intel Pentium processor. Anyway, it's uh, ESS. ES 1887 plug and play audio drive, game port, joystick, computer, computer, compu ports, com and LPT, network adapters. Planning on installing Ethernet. See what happens. ES2 mouse, my monitor, modem, keyboard, all the stuff. S Reverge. Verge DX GX PCI generic IDE disc. Let's see if I actually have DM. Oh, yeah, it does have DMA on it. Anyway, compact CD ROM light on. So, uh, let's, uh, let's just, uh, I guess this is just going to be a very quick overview because I'm going to do more detailed video of this later on. But before that happens, let's go in Microsoft Word 97. Let me type something in. Microsoft Windows 98 first edition on this compact Presario 2510 from 1998. Anyway, let's not save it, of course, and let's shut it down. Windows is shutting down and it is now safe to turn off your computer, which I will do. And I will see you guys later and bye.